god man hello cousins welcome back to cwa 11 32 a.m god damn bro i will never understand like the thought process from other people what the fuck do other people be thinking about god damn i understand that is like totally lost on y'all what the fuck is she even talking right thoughts what the fuck is she even talking about god damn Just be doing shit that don't make no motherfucking sense. So what? Hmm. I guess it comes with the territory. <laughs> Clearly has to be coming with the territory because this shit don't make no motherfucking sense. All right, so we got poverty. <laughs> I fear no evil. Yeah, so poverty, it's like you looking some dead ass in the face, like, bitch, what's up? Let's do it. Whatever this is, it's like, that's just your attitude. Like, you just going toward it, like, bitch, fuck it, let's do it. I think you're pen. <laughs> okay. Am I not supposed to say that or something? Because I said it right, and my lips literally formed another word. So. Am I not supposed to be telling your business like this or something? Because I do see what you're doing. But then that's kind of weird to put this as a general reading if I wasn't supposed to tell it. Am I supposed to be real vague or something? I don't, I don't, yeah, concern. Am I supposed to be vague or something? Okay, concern and false person. Okay. Yeah, vague. Okay, I got you. All right, so you just strolling through life, just doing your thing. La la la. La la la. Feminine or masculine, right? Just doing your thing. Great fortune is in reverse. I've been working this grave shift and I ain't made shit. I wish I could buy me a spaceship and fly past the sky. Okay, well, what fell? Yeah, unexpected income. <laughs> you know, it's funny because you look so innocent, yet I just get the feeling that you're fucking not. Now, although, yes, you do deserve whatever you do have coming in, you making, <laughs> are you milking this shit, ain't you? And I have to be vague so I cannot put your business out there because I see what the fuck you're about to do. <laughs> so just from these two cards alone and this unexpected income i see what you're about to do but you are one hell of a person oh my god you literally keep everything so close to the vest that people can't tell the difference You do this infiltration shit a little too well, huh? What's this? Yeah, adjudication, un unexpected income. You got a funny way of, um, yeah, official person. Because I, I can, I don't know how to say this when I, like, because I'm not supposed to overshare this. And I, I, like, I see that shit off top, like... Okay, do I need tarot for this or something? Because I can't. These cards is just right there in my face. Three of Wands, the Tower, the Knight of Swords, the Death, and the Queen of Cups. Yeah, you're about to drop this big-ass surprise. It's, it's, oh my God, man. What's this, what's, what's this card? Because you're playing a damsel in distress, but you're 100% not. And whatever the fuck you are about to be given or whatever you're about to... Yeah, because somebody... That's what I'm saying. Wealthy man, somebody's looking at you like a damsel in distress for some reason. Exactly. Somebody is looking at you like you're a damsel in distress. I'm not totally sure. Okay, here's... Here, okay, because I don't know how to... Okay. 
Because then, is it not a damsel in distress? What the fuck is it? Because this person, whoever this wealthy man is looking at you like, you know what? I just... Either he play like he broke and he got money or you play like you broke and you got money or both of y'all do this. I don't really know what the fuck this is. Or some, like, is that the image that somebody's giving off on purpose? It looks like you're doing that shit on purpose or they are. I see why, but that's more so it's like, it ain't none of your motherfucking business. What the fuck I got going on? What, what is this? This is like a, a strange set up off top or this is somebody that is going from like poverty and not having shit to like having everything oh my god i got a headache okay so they got everything but they're missing one thing it looks like that one thing is you i, I don't know this seems so fucking cheesy what is this seems cheesy as hell community and house this person is looking for yeah despair they they this is how this person feels when they by themselves like somebody stressed the fuck out all they want is love but okay oh okay because i'm like yo this shit here makes zero fucking sense to me i'm gonna just go with it but it doesn't make any fucking sense to me. <laughs> okay clearing up now mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah, what it is is this person can't find love. They really outside looking for love, or maybe because community and house. I just get the like a, a internet vibe off that shit, like Tinder or something. I'm going to be honest. I don't know any other dating sites. I've never been on them, but all I know is, like, all I hear y'all say is Tinder. So, is there any other ones that I could mention? I mean, I don't know. Is eHarmony still a thing? Um, But, yeah, no, this person is, like, looking for love now. It's like they not finding it nowhere. Like, they have everything. They got they got everything that they want. They got the money. I got the money. Cars and the clothes. The hoes, I suppose. I just want to be... I just want to be successful. Yeah, they want to be successful and they're looking for, I wouldn't even say help. Like, they don't want help. They just, they want love. Like, the fuck? Like, I don't motherfucking need your ass for nothing. I just want you for love, bitch. Can you love me? The fuck? Can you love me? The fuck? Yeah, so with this community and house, this seems like somebody is not having great luck finding love at all. So they're trying Tinder or are they Instagram dating? Is that a thing? I don't fucking know the dating sites. I'm not even on social media. I have fucking four YouTube channels. That This is my social media. I don't fucking know what goes on in the world anymore on purpose. <laughs> my guys was like, damn, you deleted yourself off the internet like five years ago. Ain't nobody seen you since. <laughs> Hey, be like that. It's this is peaceful over here. Only stress I got every day is my fucking rubber bands won't stay fucking in my hair. That's about it. That's about it. What's the fuck about it? And I pee all day because I drink a lot of lemon water. <laughs> you know, my problems, you know. Yeah, it seems like this person really don't got like they their problem is not money their problem is not stability their problem is nothing more than just trying to find somebody that loves them that's literally the only thing they're looking for like that's it it's all i need somebody to just like show love and affection i don't fucking need you to do shit for me that's it oh this is so lonely i'm not i mean i know my face was like like no nah, it's not like that like this is so lonely though like it's fucked up Cause what's what's crazy is I get the feeling that feminine there's a there's a feminine in the same position. Y'all are a fucking perfect match. Neither one of y'all can find what y'all looking for, and y'all just be in the house or something. I don't know community and house like just be in the fucking house. This is a perfect fucking. <laughs> it's just like when you got 
got two just low key ass people where you just like fuck it like everybody else like high vibing and shit like not that y'all not high vibing just everybody else be out here and shit like just outside outside bitch i go outside like i go sit on the fucking porch i go sit in my backyard bitch i'm not going outside outside what the fuck is out there that i need to be out there for i don't like them people the fuck if you're like that yeah despair i think this motherfucker is a perfect match for you It's not that outside is a problem. It's just uh, nothing's out there. Like, that's how they feel. Like, ain't nothing out there. Like, poverty, like, they coming in with nothing. It, and it's because they got money. Here's the thing with this person. This person has money and assets and shit, right? They don't want people. They don't want that to be the first thing that you see when you look at them. So, they also, they have to keep up a certain type of appearance because that's just them. But then, at the same time, they try to keep it kind of low-key a little bit. To where they don't want to look like a bum to where it's like, oh nigga, you broke. I ain't trying to talk to you. They not they not trying to look like that, but they not trying to they not trying to showcase all they shit either because then that's the reason that most people want them. So what's right in the middle? Damn, I can't go out there and I can't be in here. So what the fuck? Like, what's right in the middle? Like, is it anybody that's low key like me? Like, you don't like, like, you go out and shit, but you don't really like going to the clubs and you don't like, like, all this extra weird ass wild shit. Like, you got different goals and shit. Let's, let's, let's go for a walk in the park. Let me see what's up here. Let me, let me see what the fuck's up in here. Like, what the fuck? Like, let me see what your mental looking like. They can't even find nobody. Walk to the park. Take a walk through the park. Nigga, bitch, you gotta go. <laughs> we gotta go shopping, bitch. What are you talking about? Yeah, so this a this a real hold your hand, walk through the park type motherfucker. They don't be dealing with people that be trying to be on no shit like that. This is somebody looking for the things that money cannot buy. Like, this is somebody looking for an individual that they can they can truly be like, this is this who I this who I'm choosing to fuck with, like a hundred percent. Reason why is because they're willing to sacrifice and give up things for the person and the people that they love to make sure that everything can stay afloat. They're willing to go without to make sure that everybody else and everything else stays afloat. Nobody else is willing to do this shit. Now, what I say that is nobody's willing to give this person that same type of that same type of energy. And if you're looking for that, nobody's willing to give your ass the same type of energy. Again, I think you two motherfuckers right here are a perfect match. You know the sickest part about this? Because I just heard it. Clear as day. The sickest part, marriage. The sick despair. The sickest part about this shit is this person, this person right here that, that you're like, why well, I can't find the love of my life? Cause they not on the internet and they not in person I, I mean i don't know what the fuck you talking about but what i do know is the craziest part about this shit is this person for like a small percentage of y'all this motherfucker been in front of your face like for a very long time at this point and you just overlooking this person this that song you keep skipping and then you one day just like let me just listen to this motherfucking song and it's fucking fire straight flame like it's fire yeah marriage and change false person they start they they was about to lower they fucking standards i say they was about to because something tells me everything switches very fast with this but this person was literally about to just be like man fuck it like 1355 you know what fuck it like if this was out here fuck it i mean i just like, if i get divorced i get divorced fuck it yeah this somebody else was about to give up yeah, what she say? I almost gave up on love. Yeah, them niggas almost made me quit. Yeah, I could do this for hours and hours. That might be because your motherfucking ass don't want to go nowhere. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> I don't know. This this seems like y'all match up though. I just really get the feeling this person's been in front of you for a very long time and toil and labor just never went for this like whatever this is between you and this individual now again this is not everybody i just heard that for a small section of y'all some of y'all are you're gonna run into this person i don't know how but you are i mean shit some of y'all be like i work from home i don't even be outside for real. i work from home i don't go out I, I don't party i ain't on social media well i don't know what to tell you but hey divine got a funny way of making shit happen Ah, I remember Shorty made 
made the post it was like shorty made the post on, on instagram or facebook it was one of them it was like man i just want to do who just not on social media I, I just want to find me a man that's just not on social media he not all into this extra crazy shit he won't fucking comment like how he gonna find you if he not on social media like what the fuck <laughs> How you, how you supposed to find him if he ain't on social media? You looking for a dude that ain't on social media, but you're looking for him on social media. That that doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I feel like it's some shit like that. Like, you're you're trying to figure this out with methods that kind of don't make any sense, but you're comfortable. So, yeah, adjudication, main female thoughts, you comfortable. So, it's divine to make it work with this. It just so happened that you and somebody else are in the same exact energy. Y'all feel the same exact way. Y'all are attracted to each other or you will be. Thoughts. Then again, like I said, this could just be somebody that you already kind of had in front of you. This person been under your nose the whole time. Pathway, false person, <laughs> lovers, and, and courthouse. This person has been in front of your face the entire time. Here's the thing, though. It wasn't, I don't know, it's something about, like, pathway, false person, and lovers. It's something kind of just like, mm, I don't really, I don't think I see this with this person. I'm not really sure. I don't know what the hell it is that, because, like, y'all mental is all fucked up or something. I'm not really sure how to explain it. This person has been in front of your, okay, masculine. Masculine specifically, I am talking to. A small percentage of you and at this point i think you know if this if this resonates with you or not if it don't then i'm clearly not talking to you but y'all are not the you know what i ain't even trying to be funny the masculines are not the ones that i have to say if this don't resonate don't take it it's the fucking feminines like what the hell be wrong with y'all y'all be in the comments telling me shit that don't even apply to y'all and i'll be sitting there thinking like then this video didn't resonate with you what are you talking what are you talking about it's not your video then it ain't even the masculines i'll be having the having that issue it's it's the feminist but masculine you know who the fuck this is this person's been sitting in the start of three of cups and the nine of pentacles this person's been sitting in front of your face the whole time so masculine you know if this resonates for you or not i am confirming that shit if it don't resonate i ain't talking to you <laughs> the fuck not talking to you i'm also not talking about a feminine and masculine energy i'm talking about a person with a penis that identifies as a man. That's who I'm talking about right here. Okay. I ain't never had that problem. But just to clear it up real quick. Come on thighs. Moving the goddamn table around. That's why I need my wooden desk back. Nice and sturdy. <laughs> Yep, despair. Toil and labor in reverse, despair and thoughts. Yeah, that's why I said I, I had a feeling that whoever this is at this point is clicked in because they have somebody on, like whoever this masculine is, you have somebody on your mind specifically. Masculine that I am talking to with this person that is on your mind specifically, you see them clear as fucking day, right? You see the, the picture back here on the canvas? That's what he's thinking about, right? Masculine. Clear as day. So. What the fuck is your problem? I mean, because I don't know what the question is here. What are we talking about right now? The, the pathway in bad health. I get. Okay, so. They prejudged you. Or you, okay, so feminine, this masculine prejudged you. Masculine, you prejudged this feminine. That's why your ass is feeling it. That's why you're also thinking about this person. What's this? Like, that's clear as day. Like, this person completely prejudged you. All wrong. Now, I don't know what they were after. I don't know what side of the what side of the spectrum they thought you were on. I don't know if they thought you was a gold digging bitch or they thought that you was just a broke hole that ain't about shit, like, ever. But no point of that did love really make its way in the middle of this. Like, they didn't see it like that. They thought you were trying to take something from them. 
privileged lady in high honor. You came in as a blessing. They ended up with a lesson. You know, I don't know why I got this weird ass thing. I don't want no kids right now or nothing, but I swear to God, by the time I'm done, I want like five boys. I don't even know why. I don't even want any girls. I just want all boys. I have no idea why, but I think that's a, I, I feel like a prophet saying that shit like that. <laughs> like I'm going to end up with five fucking big ass boys. Like them motherfuckers going to be huge. I really, I just really get that feel. I don't know why I just felt the need to blurt that shit out too. But that came out just odd, like it was so random. It was so random. That has nothing to do with nothing. I'm just bugging out up here. That's all it is. <laughs> it's my bad. I ain't smoked today. <laughs> and I missed y'all. Fuck this. I might go live later. I'm going to probably go live later. Buy my lonesome. That way I can pay attention to the comments. <laughs> Hi, Anna. Mm-hmm. Thoughts, despair, toilet, labor, and reverse. They mishandled. Yep. What did I tell you? They mishandled the blessing. I fumbled your heart. Should have let go of my past for you. You did everything I asked of you. Travel across the country if I asked you to. But I'm just bad for you. Yeah. Lover, Steve, courtship, privileged lady, mature woman. Hey, so well, he about to get the business. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, nah, hell no. Nah. He thought you was just some random bitch. He thought you was some some little random little hoochie and shit. Nah. You and your you and your hoochie mama shoes. Hell no. I'm not going for that. No. Okay. No, ho. These hoes don't get saved no more. This person thought you was like that. Divine came through. Let me tell you something about this motherfucking person. They cut different. Yeah. I knew it was the reason I had to put on this shirt today. Hey, I knew it was a reason I had to put on this shirt today. I'm going to put my uh my brother's description or his link or whatever to his, his line, his clothing line. Yeah. Hashtag cut different. Nigga, what you talking about? Oh, oh word play like a motherfucker. Yo. The energy today is amazing. I feel like I'm in a fucking pool of water in a perfect sunny temperature. I'm just all in my element today. You better drink you some little water. I'm trying to tell you. Show. Yeah, change. Uh-huh. Yeah, nah. Somebody is. Hey, you ever seen a jerk ring flowers? Because they about to. Yeah, who you know make a jerk bring flowers? Feminine? Apparently you do. You know who make a jerk bring flowers? Yo motherfucking ass make a jerk bring flowers. Yeah, somebody thought you was a pure hoe. Ah, no, no, no. It's not that. It's just that this person, they didn't, it's like, damn, I, I can't tell. Like, is you for real? Or is you just capped out? Because the thing is, I mean, hoes know what niggas like. My friend told me that shit one day. Like, yeah, I mean, hoes know what, like, she got me because hoes know what niggas like. Like, she she was talking that shit. I was like, oh, that's what it was. It's like, yeah. I'm like, okay, you learn something new every day. But y'all know why that never dawned on me. I mean, you know what I'm saying? These man eaters would know just, <laughs> just what decided to get you. I mean, that is true. Yeah, buddy couldn't tell what the fuck you was on. Feminine, this is like specifically for you. Like, motherfucker could not tell what you was on. Do you like me for real? You want me for real? Like, do you like me for real? Or is you just, you just, is you just, is you on some other shit? Because I be on my suit and tie shit, tie shit. Like, what, it, like, what you want? Boy, let me tell you something. 
And then you can't, you clearly, feminine, I swear to God, you clearly had to have come out the gate hot. You had to. You had to. The funny thing about this shit is, I feel like this is more than one person, too, that had your ass fucked up, feminine. I swear to God, I feel like you came out the gate hot as fuck. I really do. I really do. I really do, because the next song I heard, clear as day, after suit and tie, was uh, uh, Diva. Yeah, nah, Diva is the female version of a hustler, bitch. What are you talking about? Yup, death in the four wines. Your ass came out the gate hot. I knew you did. I fucking knew you did. I knew you. I know you show up, cousin. I know how you show up. The fuck? Baby asked you. How you pull up? I pull up. What you mean? What you, what you mean? Your ass came out the gate hot as hell. Take it how it resonate, cause masculine, this could be you and the, the feminists feel a fucking way. Like, yeah, your motherfucking ass came out the gate hot. 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 Bitch. Like the middle of summer, baby. Hot. You was hot as hell. Mm-hmm. You was volcano hot. You came out the gate firing. All pistons firing. The fuck? All pistons firing. And then you just back to back with it too. Like it's it's so crazy because not this person or these people, they're constantly watching you. And the reason why is because you're just firing nonstop. Like you see these double cannons? You see all of these people firing? You see all these double cannons? Yes. You firing off. And not this person. It's like the more, the more, the harder you go. The worse this person feels like motherfuckers completely misjudged you. Privileged lady. There you are. There you is. There you is. Hmm. Hold on. Stop the track. Let me stay facts. I told you give me a minute and I'll be right back. That shit, wow, feminine or masculine, but this is clearly a feminine because masculine had you fucked up. Feminine comes out the gate so fucking hot. Then on, not only do you come out hot, bitch, you come out lighting up like the fucking, like the finale on the fireworks. Yeah, and I'm talking about the Chinese fireworks. They do it different over there. Yeah, hell no. You came out so fucking hot. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, somebody got to put some respect on your name. I mean, that's just what it is. Yeah, mature man, change in despair. Now, buddy, looking at you totally different. Hold on. I might have had you fucked up. Oh, you definitely had her fucked up. You definitely had sis fucked up. What you had? You had my cousin fucked up. That's what you had, baby. Yeah, this shit, wow. This shit, wow. Yeah, distant horizons in the pathway because everything about my energy being this high lets me know that the next phase that you finna walk into, they ain't ready for you. <laughs> and these next days. In decades? Nah, they ain't ready for you. They ain't ready for you. It's your time. Better go get it. Man, I know you said you wanted me. You better come with it. Yep. Journey and courtship. Yeah, so one of two things. Either this person's now trying to come towards you and, and, and bring make a jerk bring flowers. Or... They're sad because you're completely moving on and there may never be any coming back from this because journey and courtship, somebody is, you're literally about to be in connect. Like this is a hundred percent about that. And you're about to be in a connection with somebody else. And this person is either them coming in to make a jerk, bring flowers or somebody else is coming in and will heavy hearts daily departed. I'm sorry, because if you ever lost me, my condolences, but that's your fault, motherfucker. I'll be right back. <laughs> 